Okay, scuba girl. Kara had on her stylish wetsuit, and I had a camera. The sun was getting pretty low, so we had to hurry. No time to set a lot of stuff up, so I just set up one light, my trusty Godox AD600. Had the flash trigger on my camera. The camera was a full-frame Sony A7 III, and the lens was a Zeiss 135 1.8, set at 2.8. This is a great compact, lightweight, travel size portrait telephoto lens that you can easily take with you. It doesn't weigh much and it's kind of small, but it takes great pictures. I had a 10 degree honeycomb grid on the light, so it would only project a narrow beam on her face and chest area. And we started taking pictures. When the sun starts going down, it goes down pretty fast, so I had to keep changing my exposure. I don't think anything makes us rush more than the sky. <laughs> it's constantly changing. But Kara's a trooper. She goes along with everything we do, and she's great. It was fun. The rocks were kind of slippery from the water and the algae, so she had to be careful. But other than that, it was kind of fun. Speaking of sky, we started getting this really cool sunset, so I said, quick, change into something else. So she changed into a really cool Christian Dior bathing suit. I set up a second light to the left to kind of mimic the sun, which was going down rapidly. And we started taking pictures with the last few moments when the sun is just looking really cool. And for these pictures, I switched to my trusty little compact Zeiss 55 1.8, set at 2.8. My strobe battery was getting kind of weak, so every other picture would not flash. But I like the look of some of these pictures. Sometimes the mistakes are the best pictures. They look really good. The strobe on the left kept working because it hadn't been used yet, but the one on the right stopped working every other picture. And I started getting some really interesting pictures. I really like these. And that's another thing about photography. Expect the unexpected, and, and sometimes the unexpected turns out really cool. So be ready to adapt and flow with anything. And you could see how fast the sun went down in the background. It happened in like less than a minute. Here you can see the sun is totally gone. This picture is kind of interesting. This is looking the other direction. It was already dark out. I'm amazed we got this picture. This picture was lit with nothing but the early night sky. It's like seeing in the dark. Kind of cool. Anyway, so that was our little scuba sunset photo session. Hope you liked it. Maybe it inspired you. Stay tuned next week for some more fun photography stuff from us.